I mean, since we're actually trying to farm a particular soul, I mean, you could equip something that boosts your luck. Yes. And you can even perhaps equip a, um, instead of the gold ring, the lucky charm? A trinket. Or the yeah, lucky charm. Yeah, yeah, Just to make this process a little bit smoother. Not that we won't cut this down, but um, anyway, whilst we're doing this, what have you thought of Aria of Sorrow so far now? I really like it. Uh, there was the bit in the middle that I really, really hated, um, but it's gone a lot better since then. So basically everything so except I the arena. Am... Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I have enjoyed it. Um... How would you say this stacks up with the Symphony of the Night? I think I prefer Symphony. Um, I like, you know, having Hadoken. Like, mainly I like having Hadoken motions in that game. Fair enough. Um, but also, it feels like uh, more weapons in Symphony are actually worth a damn, whereas in this game, like, you have the sapping weapons and everything else is much worse until you get this. There we go. Yeah. No, that's, no, that's fair. I mean, I, I mean, I, I know, I know you're not married to um, the whole heavy weapon idea, but um, right now, where should we go now? Um, uh, I, I hate that there are no war points directly next to a save point. Um, well, I mean, the closest one is to um, Bina and yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, no, I do think um, probably uh, Symphony of the Night, I would say I prefer Symphony of the Night um, simply because it feels more... It feels more opulent. You know, it just feels mm. just like you're... It just feels luxurious. You know, you're going through the environments, beautiful environments, fantastic... Um, fantastic uh, music... Um, Although I do, I I do, I do really, really like Aria of Sorrow. I think it's definitely the best of the um, of the Game Boy Advance Castlevanias. Um, and okay, everything so... that this and everything that Aria of Sorrow um, explores, um, Dawn of Sorrow perfects. So if we ever get the chance to play it, we definitely should go for it. Um, All right. Okay. Well, would you like me to point you in vaguely the right direction, Nat? Yes, please. I will point you to the top floor. The top floor, I'll all right. To the top floor. For reals, though, I mean, Dawn, Dawn of Sorrow is just is 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 really great. And it has possibly my favourite cast of um, the character interactions in Dawn of Sorrow. Great. Right, so, up we go! Succubus, no! Get off me. <laughs> oh. Up here. Heading upwards. Now that we have partaken of forbidden knowledge and have done what the three handy hint books have told us to do, you know what I think we should do now? You know what I think we should do? What? I think, I think maybe, just maybe, we should equip those three souls. Alright. Flame demon. So we've got the flame demon, right? We've got the flame demon already, and then the demon from the bowels Wait, of hell, on. the king of bats, king of bats, yes, and then and the beautiful nightmare succubus. I feel like I'm being arrested for now. Cool. And from the depths of the underworld, the beautiful nightmare succubus. 
And finally, last but not least, I think we should go and show Graham how cool our sword is. All right. Hey, Graham, check this out. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're cool. You have committed an underworld crime. I mean, we I mean, this is the amount of damage that you were doing as, um, um, with, uh, Longinus' spear, but now, of course, you can just spam this attack much quicker. Mm -hmm. It's a bit of a shame, actually, because the claim solos, I mean, I know you get it, obviously, you know, you can only get it very late in the game, but it really does trivialise most bosses. It is just very good, isn't it? But then again, it's like in Symphony of the Night. Like, it's it's too easy in Symphony of the Night to end up ludicrously overpowered. Um, yeah. And it's a shame that the game doesn't... And I don't know if any of the re-releases have ever actually... Um, oh, yeah. ...enabled, like, any hard modes. Oh. I'm Dracula. Um... Obviously, you know, there are things you can do to make it harder, but... Uh, and that's something, actually, that um, some of the later... Um, uh, Castlevania, you know, some of the later Metrovania Castlevanias did enable this purpose-built hard modes. For instance, there are actually some codes, mm -hmm. um, if I recall correctly, which allow you to try the game without... Um, being able to use any of the souls except for the ones that are required to, to beat the game. Oh, I see. That's cool. Or using any items, which I think would probably be a little bit too much for me. Does this mean that I'm not Dracula? You are not Dracula! Of course you're not Dracula! Christ! Dracula's dead. Uh-oh. What's this? He was flowing into me. No way! Please stop! No! Okay. This doesn't look good, T. No. I may have pushed you down a bad path. Well, duh! Obviously, you're Dracula. Hello, son. Hi, Dad. I see. Okay. Cool. All right. So does this mean you're going to have to murder me? Oh, okay, a stream of chaos and distant castle as well. Okay, sure. Poor Simon. Generate shockwaves while you dash. Dracula's tunic. Truly, you are now Dracula. Also, have you seen his portrait? His portrait actually changes. Yeah, it rules. Oh, look at that. Look at that badass. Poor Dracula. I assume it's, oh, it's not the ability. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what I... I'm trying to recall what that final one is. Yeah, so it's an R, so. Yep. 
Does that does, awesome. does Aragardo right. have anything to say? Or is... I just talk to him. Right, that's very helpful, but if you could tell me where the chaos... I, I mean, I presume it's in the Floating Gardens, but... Oh, I mean, it's a mysterious floating black, you know, door of void. So, yeah, it does look a bit... Yeah, exactly. And I've got Dracula's uh, tunic now, so presumably... You are Dracula. Me... You are Dracula reincarnated. Yes. Well, I mean, I've got the hair. I mean, I guess we should have we should have known. Also, I I guess like you know, with the white cloak, he's kind of like got like the white you know, and he's got the he's got like the rough and everything. Mm. He's got the. Uh, he's kind of like an inverse inverse dragon. Yeah, exactly. Also, I mean, is it just me or like are enemies doing pitiful amounts of damage? Now? They really are. They are just doing not that much anymore. I wonder if there's I wonder if there's any significance to the to the souls that are required to trigger Soma's awakening. But I don't know. Can you a, a, a giant bat, demon from hell. Should we go and see hi to Mina and Terra? Um, yep. Get the poor guy. Be like, five. stop Mina. I'm Dracula now. And she's like, that's cool. I'm marrying Dracula. I'm just like... So let's talk to Hammer as well. Yeah. Maybe he'll have like something special for you know, only his Dracula clients. Hi Hammer. Hi Hammer. Okay. I mean it. Oh. Yeah, I'm Soma. Oh. Oh. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Oh. Oh. Still healed me. Soma and Mina are so cute together. <laughs> Nothing happened. I'm Whereas Hans is like, okay, okay, fair enough, whatever. We all need, you know, a hammer in our lives. No, the answer is I don't think he's got anything for his Dracula based clientele. Uh, but we'll probably want some more potions then. Not that we uh, yeah. had to really use that many because. Because we're so broken now! You're just gonna hold by a hobble anti venom just, just because we can. Yep. Well, there's only one place for us to go now. Up to yes, the floating I gardens. Think, I think the most direct route is actually from here, so yep. let's go. Uh, is it this way? Yes, it is this way. And now this music takes on a more tragic bent. Because Soma has now become... Yeah, if I'm Dracula, why are these things attacking me still? Because you're... And they're literally because, their boss. Because he's not been fully embraced by chaos. The true darkness that lies at the heart of Castle Bowman. Because the castle itself is something that's. that exists almost separately from. that exists separately from Dracula. Where are you going? Oh god damn it! Sorry, I got confused. So you know you can, you can kill Dracula, but that doesn't necessarily kill Castlevania. You got to get you got to get you got to get rid of both. Looks like the true Castlevania was in our hearts all along. Maybe the true Castlevania was the friends we made all along. No. No. Stop it. I 
Anyway. And now we get the fun um, of having to navigate through. Uh... <laughs> that is immensely satisfying. It is just great, isn't it? Oh, Bringing golems. And then there's this asshole. He's dead now. Just keep heading left and... And eventually it'll work out, yeah, you don't even need a map. We keep heading left until we can't head left anymore without hitting the clock tower, and then we just head, head right, and eventually we'll go. Okay, there we go, right. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Aha! Right, oh, here yeah. we go. Easy peasy. Mysterious room that we had all but forgotten about. Oh, the black door has opened. Yep. Stop! The Belmont has only one purpose. Julius, no! Yep. That's it. You're fighting against the Belmont. Oh, god damn it. This is like a death sentence for Dracula every time. Exactly. Like, Alucard only managed it because he was half Dracula, but I'm full Dracula. Also, Richter was being controlled by Shaft. Yeah. Here we have a fully compost mentis Julius Belmont, aka the most powerful Belmont there ever was. Okay. Um. Now uh, Black Panther's probably fine for this. Although... Although I think Death might be better. And then Killer Mantle. <laughs> you are a poor Belmont, for you cannot deal with ranged weaponry. Nah, this is. I'm willing to play this game forever. This is not. This is. This is. This is not the epic showdown I had envisaged. <laughs> Juice is all like. The real Dracula would never you... be so cheap. Yeah, well, I'm not the real Dracula. I'm just so over Cruz. cruise. Oh god, him. He's got a dike cat now. I've got Mad Man now. Now I have to man fight him. Okay. I mean, he also does obscene amounts of damage. And he can friggin' teleport! Okay, I've decided. Uh, sod playing for when I am a genius. Because, <laughs> you know, these sides deal more damage than my goddamn sword does to him, apparently. Um, I mean, one thing is the Claim Solace is presumably a Claim or Clave, Clave Solace, um, is presumably a holy sword. Oh shit. Oh, what the heck are you doing now? He's doing, he's doing Richter's ultimate Grand Cross. No. Oh. Um, he's presumably holy um, elemental. Ooh, maybe. So, Richter, what if, if we you've equip? got something that's dark... Ah, Calibog. Oh shit. He's now using uh, famous other attacks. Ah, now that's better. Yeah, that deals a lot more. I presume the side is a dark elemental, which is why they deal so much damage. I wouldn't be surprised. They are death sides, you know? See, he's got all the sub weapons. He is, a, so he, good. he is a true Belmont. And he's also got like red red jeans, which are amazing. Ha <laughs> ha suck it. Stop! I've had enough of running away from you while my sides stab you. He was taking it easy.
crows to the end. Oh, I can't speak to him anymore. All right. I think you definitely want to go and save. Poor old Simon. He thought he was just having a nice, a nice trip to the to a shrine with his girlfriend, but his life is everything has gone horribly wrong. His life has been ruined in a flash. All right, well, T, we have the final area in the game. How do you know where the final area is? Because I think I think we should catch a glimpse of it. We should, yes. Things are falling apart. What the heck is this? The Black Sun! Oh, man. The chaotic the realm. The chaotic realm. Oh. So cool. Ooh, and there's a save point exactly. in the chaotic realm. A handy save point. I think we should save. But yeah. So this is this is in you know, in the grand tradition of all um, well, you know, a lot of you know final areas. It's a bit of a mishmash of previous areas. Very cool. And there's no, there's no map. map, obviously. Because you're in the chaotic realm. You're in the shadow realm. Time to send you to the chaotic well, realm, Soma. <laughs> I'll send your soul to the chaotic realm. And then you must defeat me in a children's card game to bring it back. I can't believe I'm actually going to die. Oh. <laughs> right guys so thank you all very very much for watching we're gonna leave it here just outside the chaotic realm and then presumably get the true ending next week yeah the final which is gonna be very very final cool. chapter man well i've been enjoy I i've enjoyed this uh run through and the defeat of dracula well, the defeat of graham twice so uh, exactly. i'm looking forward to how this game ends up so thank you all very, very much for watching, and we will catch you all next time. Adios.